what's up? Welcome back to another video. It's your girl Minuet. Today we're talking about rest. And whether you're a new parent or not, rest is extremely important for your mental health. I'm at about a year right now and I fluctuate between some nights are better than others, but for the most part, my son does sleep through the night. Wakes up for a morning feed and I'm so thankful because around like four months is when he started sleeping through the night. What I really wanted to talk to you guys about is not being so hard on yourself when you don't get to clean your floors or you don't get to the laundry or the dishes. I'm not gonna lie to you, trying to get out of the house is like preparing for the Olympics when you're a new mom. But if you have more than one kid, you know what I'm talking about. I only have one kid and it's so hard. If you can, you take a shower, take a bath, take care of yourself because the baby is gonna need you again very soon, all right? And if you can, hire help, good for you. Go for that, hire help. If you can get your man to help, poof, even better. Get your man to help. Uh, you know, it's more than just helping with the baby or changing diapers. Get your man to do the floors. Get your man to help out because it is a full-time job taking care of a baby, all right? And if you're a support person watching this video, you are in the right place because your woman is gonna appreciate you so much for learning these tips. If she comes home or she wakes up from a nap and you did the floors, you did the dishes, boy, I tell you, you are gonna get the best treatment of your life because we don't wanna have to do it all. Long story short, sometimes taking a nap is more important than combing your hair. If you can put your hair in braids, do you know some sort of protective hairstyle with it, that way you're not constantly trying to get your hair done. I got bangs before I had the baby because I knew that it was gonna be too much work, all right? So whatever you can do, do it. Whatever's gonna be able to help you take that extra nap, go for it, because you need it. Your mental health will thank you, all right? You basically become a machine that is constantly eating and eating, eating and eating. And when your body's producing milk, you're actually eating way more than when you're pregnant. I know, I'm not saying this to scare you, but just get ready. Your grocery bill's gonna go up. Your plan, if you're thinking about having a baby, just make sure you have your finances in check first because the price of groceries spiked astronomically. Again, you're gonna be, you're gonna need to nap, you're gonna to wanna to make sure you have meals prepped. Watch my other videos if you want some more tips on how to get this done and make it a little bit easier for you. For your partner, for your mental health, it's not gonna be easy. But you will get through the year a little bit easier. If, if you are planning on breastfeeding, just make sure that you're doing the things that you need to to, to withstand. So like fruits, vegetables, uh, more protein all of these things are gonna go in high gear after that baby comes out so just get ready for it all right rooting for you mama rooting for you and your support team you got this thanks for watching my video i appreciate you so much namaste bye 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 come back again peace out